हेलो बी एस सी सेकेंड इयर स्टूडेंट लिसन इन इन टूडे ऑनलाइन लेक्चर वी स्टडी हियर द पेंटोज फॉस्पेट पाथवे पेंटोज फॉस्पेट पाथवे एज पर द सिलेबस इट इज ऑल्सो कॉल्ड एज द एच एम पी शंट सो लिसन इयर केयरफुली and try to understand and remember this metabolic pathway pentose phosphate pathway is a metabolic pathway and it is parallel to the glycolysis glycolysis we have already studied so this hmp shunt or pentose phosphate pathway is a metabolic reactions metabolic pathway and parallel to the glycolysis we will study here uh, line to line sentence to sentence because due to the corona pandemic 19 our examination is in mcq form so we have to study line to line sentence to sentence because mcq is a question so it is very we have to deep study now this pentose phosphate pathway is a precursor for synthesis of the nucleotides remember pentose phosphate pathway is a precursor for the synthesis of nucleotides it involves oxidation of glucose pentose phosphate pathway or hcmp shunt involves in the oxidation of glucose then its primary role is anabolic rather than the catabolic for pentose phosphate pathways primary role is anabolic rather than the catabolic this pathway is also called as the oxidative pentose pathway remember question in the mcq form may be the pentose phosphate pathway is also called that that dash one correct option that is oxidative pentose pathway and three false options you have to choose the correct option and darken that option a b c d you have to dark on your omr sheet when you are in the offline examination and if you are choice the online examination so you click that so here it also called as the oxidative pentose pathway and hexos monophosphate pathway hexos h yes, monophosphate and pathway p or it is also called the shunt s h u n t it exists in both pentose phosphate pathway or hmp shunt exists in both prokaryotic as well as eukaryotic cells we have studied the prokaryotic cells where no definite nucleus is there and eukaryotic cells where there is a definite nucleus or nuclear membrane and nucleoplasm is closed in the envelope of nucleus called as the nuclear membrane so here it exists in both prokaryotic cell as well as the eukaryotic cell this is also known as the pentose phosphate pathway pentose phosphate pathway oxidative pentose pathway and also known as the pentose phosphate pathway hmp shunt is alternative pathway to glycolysis parallel or alternative to the glycolysis 
now here due to the limitation of the board work from the home so here the most important function is in the formation of NADH2 and pentose sugar remember the most important function of pentose phosphate pathway is in the formation of NADH2 and pentose sugar dear students here work from the home or online lectures i am sending the link in whatsapp group and you can see that on youtube also again and again this is the benefit for the video making the video lecture or youtube lectures on the google meet the students those are absent they are unable to see or to listen here the students those are absent they can also open the link and they can also study they can also observe they can also listen again and again so remember why i am conducting the online lecture on uh, youtubes or as a video clip remember that is the reason you can study you can listen again and again so here this pathway pentose phosphate pathway or hmp shent here we can study in the form of reactions so here glucose 6 phosphate is undergoes in the reversible reaction it form the 6 phospho gluco delta lactose and here the enzyme glucose 6 phosphate dehydrogenase is catalyze this reaction so ase remember this ase when it is ending by ase so that is the enzymes so glucose 6 phosphate is converted into the 6 phospho gluco delta lactose here reversible arrows are shown then this 6 phospho gluco delta lactose is converted into the 6 phospho gluconate here the biological catalyst or enzyme is lactonase ac again here as so it is a enzyme which catalyzes the reaction which is essential for the reaction biological reactions here then 6 phospho gluconate is converted into d ribose five phosphate here again the enzymes are used enzymes catalyze the reaction then d ribose five phosphate is converted into the d ribose five phosphate and here the pathway is completed in the different stage first stage then second stage then third stage fourth stage in different stages the different enzymes are used as a biological catalyst so dear students this is the last bit from our unit 3 so today we have completed the unit 3 and in unit 3 the last bit the pentose phosphate pathway hmp shunt you can see the syllabus you should have the syllabus remember here is the syllabus and this syllabus i have given in the class in offline lecture as well as this syllabus which is new for your batch so that syllabus is sent on the whatsapp group also so all of you should copy that syllabus from your mobile and you should have it in the uh, on first page of your registers so dear students this was the 
last bit remain from the unit 3 so today the unit 3 is completed and in next period we will start the unit 4 so unit 4 is only remain we will complete syllabus within time and tomorrow in morning I will send the one PDF file the content of that PDF file is the notes of unit first so you read that notes or you can write from the mobile to your register and simultaneously you make the MCQs you read that notes sentence to sentence point wise notes I have prepared so each and every point can make a MCQs we will make MCQ on each and every points so you have to make the MCQ I will also give the MCQs question bank and again one thing which is the test and tutorial for the internal assessment so I will send the one question for the test then another question for the tutorial so you make the notebook you attach friendly the Xerox of test tutorial notebooks and you can use the ruling papers you make a good test tutorial notebooks attach the Xerox paper and cut the extra ruling papers which is coming out to me Xerox the paper orun lauta and techa khali ruling paper lining paper tela staple karta lining paper lam side che and ha covering paper je hai varcha he chota side che asa hote manun kay karaycha tela eka size madhe kaichi na katrun asa vyavasthit art and craft je shikota techa upyog ithe karaycha and changli test tutorial chi notebook banvaycha hai techa madhe test first आधी लिया इच्छा है, तेज़ अंतर ट्यूटोरियल फर्स्ट लिया इच्छा है, तेज़ अंतर थर्ड एंड फोर्थ यूनिट वर्ती, टेस्ट नंबर सेकंड, एंड देन ट्यूटोरियल नंबर सेकंड, सो प्लीज रिमेम्बर दिस, तुम्हारा पहले अंदर टेस्ट फर्स्ट लिया इच्छा है, तेज़ अंतर ट्यूटोरियल फर्स्ट लिया इच्छा है, � and the tutorial second reaction. notebook made a char person Don't test and don't tutorial. And a sequence is right. Test first. Then you have to write the question. Tomorrow, test first. Sati kai question there at the question reaction. And then you have to write the answer. You first read the notes and keep that notes aside and honestly you solve that question you write that question honestly don't see in register yet the watch it register bazaar at you answer and in jay prasna after a test at the delay tell a honestly upon very bassoon liaita similarly about the tutorial also I will give another question so tutorial first there is one question again you have to read that notes and keep the notes aside and write by remembering honestly so dear students for today it is sufficient thank you very much